Hi, how are you? It's Travis in here, and welcome back to our adventures in the season of Discovery. Last episode, we acquired the Divine Storm Ruin. And today, we are in Scarlet Monastery Graveyard. We only have three people. We have a priest and a warlock and myself. We are, I guess, waiting for more people to join. Hopefully some more join soon. And I was going to wait, but these guys just kept on going, so... Let's see if we can three-man this dungeon. There's also... something we can get in this dungeon. I remember Touch got it on his paladin when we were playing. And it increases the... the time limit of our blessings by... by another five minutes. So our might, blessing of might, instead of being only five minutes, will last for ten. So hopefully we get that in these runs. If we don't, then whatever it is, what it is. But it would be nice if we could get that. Not too sure what it drops off of. But I remember him getting it down in that area. Could probably loot everything that we can, just in case. We should get level 31 today after a, a few runs of Scarlet Monastery Graveyard. It is a quick dungeon, guys. There's only one boss. And it's uh, Blood Mage Thalnos, and he drops uh, an offhand for, for priests and warlocks. There are some rares that you can find that drop some pretty nice loot. But that's about it. Not much loot for us in here. Other than the, the the thing we get that gives us, you know, another five minutes on our blessings. It's really what we're trying to get here today. Alright, so let's use some Divine Storm, guys. Look at all that damage we just did. Pretty damn good. We are using Steel of Command now, since we, uh, you know, don't have heal a martyrdom anymore. Yeah, Divine Storm's putting in work, guys. We're doing damage. Keeping up with this priest, and this priest is actually level 39. Divine Storm was uh, the ability there that did the most damage. 1.2k. So I'm happy we got that. And today is the launch of Phase 3, guys. We're 10 levels behind. Too bad. But it is what it is. We'll try to catch up. We'll try our best. I think we'll catch up. Oh, my gosh. Sorry, guys. Baby aggro. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, well, heal me, dude. I don't know if we can actually do this. We need to get that guy down. Come on, get, get him down. Satana needs to stay alive. Okay. Heals me. Nice. I still have my bubble. Which is great. It's, it's stun one now. I think we can fear them, too. With, uh... Yeah, I might have to, like, heal this guy. He's gonna die. Die, dude. Oh, gosh. Here we go. Killing him. We got this. Awesome. Go, we did it. I didn't even have the buff. I didn't have fortitude from the priest either. All right, so I don't know what's going to happen now. The warlock just left us. And it's just me and the priest, guys.
Maybe it'll keep going. I should have brought more waters. I only have 23. I think my hearth's set to Astronar. That's so far away. Looks like we're going to keep going. I respect it. I really respect this, uh, the dedication of this priest. I wonder what he's looking for. I have a feeling he could be doing the... I can't believe I've got the name of the rune. I did it on my priest. You have to go to this graveyard here in uh, Scarlet Monastery Graveyard. I think it's called Pain Suppression. And you have to collect... I think they're called me like memories from these graveyards. And then you have to go to Scarlet Monastery Library and go to these, like, s statues and paintings and then use the proper memory on each statue, I guess. And then after that, you get the ability and suppression. Pretty cool question. They did a great job with the quest chains for runes. I've, I've really enjoyed them. Shooting out of their cross bolts. We gotta find more people though. Look at all the people trying to do <laughs> SM Cathedral. Once we get there, we'll find a group easily. It's a few levels away though. Molten Core. Sunken Temple. No one's doing Sunken Temple yet. There's no way. Alright, so over here is where the graveyard is that he has to go to. Now, I'm wondering if this is what is, is what he's like really trying to do. I doubt he's in here for XP. But if we help him just do this, I don't mind. So I'll try to find another group for Graveyard. Yeah, the Graveyard's right here. I think right here or something like that. And that's where he gets the memory. He's like, yeah. <laughs> yeah that's exciting. There you go. It's good to see that he's getting that. And then we got a fortitude after that. I don't know if there's anybody else. Looking for more SM chats. Tank spam. Yeah, it's hard to find people for Graveyard. Everyone just does Cathedral, it seems like. But we'll keep on trying. If, if we can't really find a group, then maybe we'll just go do some quests. It'd be nice to get a few levels from here and then make our way over to Desolus. And then we can pick up the... Scarlet Monastery West. Where we have to slay some bosses in Cathedral Armory and Library. Oh, we're doing it. Just one level 39 in me. 
probably clear this whole place. I have a feeling this person might be done, though. They got, they got what they needed. But maybe they'll keep on going. get aggro off of this priest, but this is what it is. He's a much higher level than us. Speaking of XP. We'll do that later. Try to get that XP buff. I've totally forgot about getting that cozy sleeping bag buff. This add-on here is called LFG Bulletin Board. It's a good way to organize all of the looking for group spam. That is a pain to go through. I think a lot of people would not even do dungeons if they actually had to look at that to, to get into a group. So this organizes everything, which is nice. So you don't even really have to look at looking for group chat spam. So looks like we're actually going to go through the whole thing, just two of us. Let's see how this goes. There we go. Nice pull there. That's a big ass pull. We're actually doing a pretty big pull here. So I guess you can two man it as long as you have one person who's you know, level almost level forty. You can easily two man this dungeon. I wish this priest could potentially solo it. But I think he'd probably run out of mana eventually. I should have hodged him there. That was a mistake. here maybe no too late so we had a little bit of time there for one more DPS. Damn it. 
I don't want to leave. Well, I'm not going to leave this guy hanging. I guess he'd be cool to finish this to see if we can actually do it. But I do want to do more than just one run. It would be nice to get level 31 and also the, the buff to our blessings. should drink up after this. But we actually don't run out of mana, really, as a rep paladin. Every time we use Crusader Strike, regenerates 5% of our maximum mana. Yeah, Divine Storm. Awesome ability. Probably the best ability we can get in our chest slot. Have a drink here. Get ready to fight the last boss. Let's do this. For vengeance. Imagine this guy just left me to soul. He just starts hearthing. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Just hearths out. I have to solo Thalmos. Don't think we would be able to do that. Can I stun him? No. Nope. Can't stun him. Yeah, my single target kind of sucks. The Divine Storm. Heal the Martyrdom probably would be better. Single target damage. Yeah, this priest is carrying me here. And the Blood, man, blood Mage Mantle dropped. 8 Intellect, 4 Spirit, 35 Armor, Cloth, Shoulders. All right, guys. Well, that's the end of this graveyard run. I think we were most likely done. I think the, the priest probably just wanted to get that memory for the ruin, pain suppression ruin. And I'm going to try to find another group. So I will see you guys then. Oh, actually getting attacked by a, by a mob here. Well, a couple mobs, actually. Yeah, after this, we're going to do that. I'm going to try to find another another group. Hopefully that one that I've seen was, is still looking. So it looks like we're going to keep on going. Everything that we were fighting spawned back because of how long it's taken us to, uh, to deal with all this stuff. I'll, th I'll take it, though, man. It's easy XP. Well, not really. Probably be a lot easier if we were in a group of, of five. Stun that? No, I almost missed that stun. Look at priest is running out of mana. He just keeps spawning, man. 
<laughs> and a hat drop. The emblazoned hat. Seven stamina, six intellect, six spirit, 77 armor. Do we have a helmet? We don't. I'm going to actually take that. Now we have a helmet. I think we stayed. Oops. Oh, look at that hat. It's pretty good. Maybe we'll get the, the the ruin on the way back, or I don't know what it's called, but it's like a scroll or something like that. I didn't know you could just stand in this dungeon and just slay all the mobs that get spawned here. I've got a greater healing pot as well. I bring those ones in as well. I think this would be the way we would get our first helmet. Pretty close to 31. Far and a half away. Oh, this guy drops it. I know it drops off one of the mobs in here. But yeah, guys, it looks like that is it for now. I'm going to try to find another group for our graveyard. Hopefully, we can find one soon. We found a group, guys. Didn't take too long. We have a warlock tank, priest healer, and a mage and hunter DPS. I am DPSing on the paladin. Hunter's doing damage, man. He's level 38. It's gonna wreck. Oh, looks like the warlock leveled up. be okay. I'll rip the secret. 
could smell your flesh. Well, looks like we might not get it, guys. few more mobs left. Yeah, it didn't drop. It's too bad. I wonder if you can get it from the other dungeons. I'll have to look it up. I just remember seeing it drop from here. I would be willing to do another run. If this one's pretty quick. I think this one's going to be fast. AOE damage in this group. And there we go. We leveled up. Now, what do we take, guys? Fruit Ret Aura. Increases the damage done by your Retribution Aura by 25%. We also have Pursuit of Justice. Increases our movement speed. And our mount speed by 4%. Doesn't stack with other effects. And then we have uh, Vindication, gives a Paladin damaging melee attacks. Chance to reduce the target strength and agility by 5% for 10 seconds. And then we have Eye for an Eye. All spell criticals against you cause 15% of the damage taken to the caster as well. Damage caused by Eye for an Eye will not exceed 50% of the Paladin's total health. Let's just buff everybody up here. I guess we'll take Pursuit of Justice. Movement speed is nice. So we'll take that. I didn't really see anything that would increase our damage by too much. So we'll go with the movement speed. Sage's Pants of the Owl dropped. 8 Intellect, 8 Spirit, 39 Armor, Cloth Legs. Check speed we're getting per mob here. Probably less than we did with the priest. No, it's the same. That's actually more. We were getting like hundreds and something up there. The English dead.
Warlock tanks do a solid amount of damage. It's mostly from Searing Pain. And Shadow Cleave. Oh, they got a boss here. Got a rare. Azure the Sleepless. See what he dropped. Nine stamina. Increases damage and healing done by magical spells and effects. By up to five. It's a nice neck, but I'm just going to greet it. It's okay for us. But, yeah, we'll let the... It's more for casters. Also seeing a lot of the uh, Zulfarax spam groups. I had a feeling that would be a dungeon people would spam sort of like they did last phase with Scarlet Monastery. It's gonna pull a bunch and bring them here. Let's see how this goes. drink here while we wait. We can probably kill them. We got a lot of AoE in this group. And we also have the level 38 hunter. So we should be just fine. I just hope he can survive pulling them all and actually coming up here. He's doing pretty good. We're fighting right here. Okay. It's good to me. Yeah, the mage is doing so much damage. Can't compete with mages and hunters. I think it's level 38 hunters. But especially mages in AoE. Just do too much damage. Oh, nice hands. More damage for us, so I guess we'll take those. Limbering mail gauntlets. Seventh strength, three agility, and a little bit more armor, 10 more armor than our other gloves. 124 armor. Oh, and since we swapped our gloves, we lost Crusader Strike. Put that on after this pull.
Okay. Let's get Crusader Strike back on. Mage leveled up to 30. And the Blood Mage Mantle Shoulders dropped once again. Not bad. We did not get the item that we wanted, guys. If these guys want to go again, I am down. But if not, then I guess we'll just have to come back here another time. Maybe a level 40 and just farm it ourselves as a prop paladin. Here we go again. We lost the hunter and the priest, but we got another warlock and a druid now. And this druid's level 41. Already got a level in the new phase. And I guess the druid wanted to come to SM to do SM Cathedral and get a few levels before I guess you go to Zulfarak. Hopefully we get what we want here. I wonder if this group will be a little bit faster. We have, I think, more people doing damage. We have to see. We don't have that hunter doing damage. We have a druid that's healing and doing a little bit of damage. Watchman Pauldrons. Three strength, 11 stamina, four spirit. We don't have shoulders, so I'm needing them. Tell me, tell me everything. And we won. I'm gonna put those on here. And we have to delete something. I guess we'll get rid of some of this, uh, this mage water. Tanks going down. Those are BOE. Could sell them on the auction house, but we won't do that. We don't want to eat shoulders. We got our first set of shoulders and our first set of our first helmet in here, so that was good. Actually got a little bit of loot. those on and there we go we got some shoulders guess doesn't look like we got the item we wanted though not gonna fight Boral just want to loot everything here bloody knuckles some more Get rid of that. Keep getting the silk. We actually need silk. Anything out here? Doesn't look like it. But yeah, it's too bad. Didn't drop again. Sky Sash. Cloth Waste. What do you do with these Crusaders, Maces? They must be for a ruin or something like that. 
Might be for a paladin rune. Look at this pull. Oh my gosh. Mages like pull it all. That would be awesome. mobs is up to four enemies so any any pull that has more than four enemies any other like class that doesn't have like a cap on aoe damage it's going to completely wreck us so that's how many sorry divine storms capped it seems to be four enemies That was a good pull, though. Looks like this druid's gonna tank. I don't blame him. Probably has more health and armor than the warlock. What a pull this is. Should be okay. I can heal myself. Let's puff everybody up here. Mage still needs water. Mana, I should say. See what happens here. Nice pull by the druid, though. Get a rare this time. It's too bad. Let's help heal this warlock up. I have a little bit of a drink here. All the warlock pulls. I bet a whole group of mages could have pulled this entire room. Easily. Maybe need a priest though, just to pop them off. We get a rare spawn? Mage said he's seen one. I wonder where it is. I guess I'm wrong. <laughs> Trolling us there. Yeah. 
All right, off to the crypt we go. It's gonna do the big crypt pull. Oh, iron spine. Is that is that the that's that the rare? It is. There he is. But he wasn't trolling. Oh wow. Really nice chest for us. We have to get rid of something now. Get rid of this one water. And there we go, guys. Iron Spine's ribcage. We're actually getting decked in here. What this is, it's a male chest, 235 armor, big strength, three agility, and 17 stamp. So much stamina. It's less strength than our other chest. I think it does. No, it doesn't at all. I'll have to put Divine Storm on it, though. What are level it's for? Level 30. Nice, so we can wear it now. We're actually getting a lot of gear in here. I don't really expect to get much gear at all or, or, or any. We're actually getting a decent amount. I wonder how that shield is. Shield just dropped. Probably better than the one we have. So we'll just... We'll need it. We can use it if we ever... Tank again. We should tank again soon. We have a much better chance of getting into uh, dungeon groups. We tried to tank. But I, I want to use this mace for as long as I can. Varigan's fist. We'll try to stay red as long as we can, but I will be tanking here and probably have to change our spec as well. There we go. Blood Mage Mantle again. We haven't seen the offhand once. Yeah, we haven't seen the Orb of, of the Forgotten Seer once, guys. That's kind of unfortunate. All right, well, that's another run down. I think the Druid is most likely done. I think he just came to give us, to help us out one time. We gave him a summon. So, decided to help us out because of that. And the tank left, so yeah, that is most likely the end of our Scarlet Monastery graveyard runs. I enjoyed them. It's too bad we didn't get the blessing, the thing to buff, buff our blessings. Or maybe I got it. I just need to check my bag, but I think we didn't get it. So we'll eventually probably have to come back here and farm it. But that's fine. We got some nice loot, guys. We got some new shoulders, the Watchman Pauldrons, the Embolzoned Hat, and also this chest, the Iron Spine Ribcage. It looks like this. Look at that. What a chest. All right, guys. Well, that is going to be the end of today's episode. As always, thanks for watching. Keep your heads up. Later.